Okay, so what we want to do is use two mics, you know, just because it ends up being a much better kind of sound. Make sure I check the pattern and not mess up. So we'll get one down here out in front of the bridge. that and then we're going to get one up above and kind of like that facing down and is that going to clear bowl there or is that yeah a lot of times when I'm designing gear, you know, and it's all great and wonderful to be sitting on a workbench and make a measurement and oh gee this really works but I find it really necessary and desirable to know how things actually perform in the studio. I want to make sure I got headroom, I'm not pushing something at some stage in the thing where, you know, it could be causing a bad sound kind of issue. cello was recorded you know into two channels of the spider directly into pro tools no processing no compression no eq and it just turned out that acoustically in the room and the mic placement you know it really worked pretty well the vocal mic because because of so much dynamic range involved with the vocal i did some gentle compression while i was recording actually using the tracker compressor in sort of a air optical mode you know and maybe six seven db of compression on, on, the, on the louder parts and what she was doing and, and this you know generally helps her a little bit and it, and it also helps you know from the whole recording aspect of it because cheryl has a just tremendous dynamic range and if you let her go it's going to be very difficult to deal with. Now there was a feeling that I've ever had. One of the areas of research that, that I'm pursuing at the moment is we all know what CDs sound like, we all know what tape sounds like, we all know what vinyl sounds like, and I'm pursuing to find out, understand what the differences are, even at a greater detail, to see if I can improve what the whole digital world sounds like. And ultimately, you know, studio guys are in love with what tape sounds like, but you know, good tape doesn't really sound like all that much. 